Good day, good morning, good morning, good morning, learners, good morning. Yes, you know what time it is. It is 8 a.m. on a Wednesday, and it is time for grade eight. Grade eight English home language. I welcome everyone who's here. Yes, I welcome everyone who's here. Let us quickly take the register. Let us see who is here with us. If you are there, please say hi in the chat. Let us see who is with us today. Yes, yes, so good to see your name. So good, so good. Hi, everyone, you are welcome, you are welcome. So I hope everybody is doing good, everybody's okay. Yes, today it, it is the, that day of our assessment. So in today's lesson, I will just be presenting the, the assessment and I will also let you know where you, where you can get it, okay? Where you can get the paper so that you can write it, okay? So what you need to know is that you will be given up until 10 p.m. tonight to finish this. So yes, so 10 p.m. tonight, it is the deadline. So make sure that you finish way before then, way before then this uh, assessment is not that long. Yes, I think it can take you only an hour to complete. Yes, only an hour to complete, it can take you that long. So yes, the deadline, by the way, is 10 p.m. And I will also let you know where you can find the paper so that you can write it, so that you can bring, so that you can write and submit it so that we can assess you to see how, to see how far you are in your progress of understanding and grasping everything that we should have done so far, okay? So thank you so much for joining us. Um, do not be nervous, please. Stay calm, uh, calm down, calm down, it's good, it's going, it's going to be okay. It's going to be okay. Um, yes, let us all calm down, it's going to be okay, I promise you. And I really can say that given the way that we should have been in most of our lessons, I really believe in you that you will, be do, you will do well in this assessment. I mean, you guys you have been, you have been participating, you've been asking questions and you really have been showing how you have been showing that you you really are awesome learners you really are excellent and you have been i have seen that you have been doing well you've been understanding everything you've been grasping what you've been doing so i know that you will you will do well in in this assessment and i know from my side i did my best to prepare you and I also know that from your side, you also did your best to really be prepared to do the assessment today. Okay, all right. So is there any question before we start? Before I start presenting the paper for you, is there any question? Is there any question? So, okay, I will just take a few moments as I, as I wait for your questions.
Like I have said, I am giving you just two minutes as I anticipate your questions. Okay, and let me write the link for where you can get the, the paper. So as I await your questions, remember we said that um, you should be done with this by 10 p.m. tonight and it should be in and submitted so that we can be able to assess your work, your, yes, your, your assessment. Okay, so let us see what we have as questions. Okay, okay, no questions, no questions, no questions, no questions, no questions. All right. So about the assessment, okay, what you need, what you need to do, let, let us, let me start with it. Okay, so this is how our our assessment is okay so section one is creative work which is for 10 marks Okay, and section two will be section two will be grammar, which is worth 15 marks. Okay, so you realize that so you so you realize that this, okay, section one being 10 marks, this being 15. So if you do your math, 10 plus 15 is 25. So this will be out of 25 marks. Okay, so remember, remember, since this is an assessment, we are expecting you to answer all questions. Okay, so you'll be expected to answer all the questions, okay? All the questions. If there's any question you're having problem with, please just try, okay? Do not, do not leave a question unanswered, but just try, okay? Just try, just try, so yes. Okay, so remember, 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 remember. Okay. All right, let, let us let us let us continue. Um as far as about submission, I see there is a question about how we upload how we upload, you know, yes, how, how, how the questions about uploading, how you can submit. So I will answer you on that a bit later before the end of the lesson. Yes. Okay, so you can download the paper here. 
So I will leave this screen a bit so that you can write this down. The web address Africa Teen Geeks to see the zero four slash STEM digital school. Okay, so this is where you can get to the, this is where you can get the paper. So please just write down this address. Okay, so this is the address where you will find your lesson. This is the address where you will where you will find the This is the address where you will find the paper and remember that you should you should submit by 10 p.m. tonight and you know you are not going to get your marks immediately. Uh tomorrow, okay. Tomorrow and Friday we are going to we are going to go through the paper together to show you how you are supposed to answer the questions, okay? And you are also going to get your marks after, after that, yeah, to see, how, to, see how, to see how you performed, okay? So yes, but then after, okay, since you'll be submitting tonight, the deadline will be 10 p.m. Please, please keep to the deadline, okay? Please keep to the deadline. Like I've already said, it can take you about only, only an hour to finish this. Okay, so it can only take you an hour to finish this. Therefore, you, since it will only take you an hour to finish this, then therefore, you know, you can just give yourself any, any hour during the day and just finish the paper so that you can, so, so that you can submit, okay? So did you hear what I said? You go, you go here to Africa Teen Geeks Dossier Dossier, Okay, STEM Digital School, that is where you will get your paper. Okay, is, does everyone understand this procedure or is there any question about how you are going to get your paper? Any question, any question? I am anticipating your questions. Is there any question? So I see you have Bonet saying saying that they are lost. Bonet, what is your question? What don't you understand here so that we can help you? Bonet, you can raise your hand so we can hear what your question is. Bonet, you can please say, oh yes, there is Bonet's hand. Let us hear what Bonet is saying. So, sir, yes, Bonnet, are you there? Yes, I'm um, here. Yeah. Yes, what is your question? How do we submit the marks to you so when we're done with, with the assessments and everything? Oh yes, uh, I was still I was still coming to that towards the end because I first need to I first need to make sure that you understand how to get the paper, you know. Oh okay, yes. so yeah. and then after that, yeah. So I am going to explain all these things step by step, you know. Yeah, starting from the beginning up until where it ends. Okay, so yes, I will still come on with that to tell you how you have to submit your your answers. Okay. Okay, so I need I need to know, do you all understand how we are going to get the paper? All 
Oh, it seems like we have questions about how to get the paper. So I think I will just open my web browser to show you how to get the paper. So in just a moment, Okay, now let me share, let me share my screen. Okay. Uh, let me go to the web browser so we... Okay, so I'm going to share my screen. I'm going to my web browser. Okay, so remember what is the link? The link is Africa in geeks.co.za forward slash stem hyphen digital hyphen cool okay so let us wait for it to load as you wait we wait we wait we wait okay so now i'm showing you where you can get the paper Okay, as we wait, let's wait. All right, so this is our website. Okay, we can you all see it? If you can see it, please just type hi, say yes in the chat. Okay, yes, yes, so here, here it is, okay. So you see here to download or view the assessments, please click on links below. So remember we are grade eight. So let's click on grade eight there. Then we look for English home language. There it is, the third one. Then we wait as it loads. So yes, let's be patient. This is not 5G. <laughs> All right, okay. So, okay, since we, we clicked on grid eight and it opened a new link for us, then, okay. Okay, so the grade eight here, yeah, English home language. Okay, so since you have registered, then you will need to. Okay, let's see where are the test, where's the test, where's the test. Remember, since all of you have registered, then you should be able to to access the test. Okay, so so if it happens that perhaps maybe you cannot access it, you can email me during the day, and I can I, and I can help you. Okay, so yes, so you so you realize that after. Okay, let's wait. Okay, so, okay, I, sorry, I was in the wrong folder. So yes, remember that since you have registered, then, then you will have to log in, right? Then yeah, okay, the the links Okay, yeah, since you've been writing natural science yesterday, I I know you know how to do it. So yes, you go here to, 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 to okay, for, for English home language for grade eight, okay? All right, then, and then what you're going to do is that at the end of the test, there is a button. Okay, let me go back to our,
Yes, so, so at the end of the test, there is a button which says submit. Okay, then you will click on it. And then after that, it will redirect you to, it will redirect you to the drive. Okay, so in the drive, that is where you can, that is when you can upload, okay? Or if maybe you, if maybe you cannot be able to attach your test, then you can email it through the link. Okay, so you'll get all that after you, after you have, after you are done with the test itself. Okay, and then, and then, and then with the questions which have long paragraphs, what you can do is that you can scan or take a screenshot of your paragraph and you send it back on the right side. There will be a button which says upload pictures or upload photos or upload copies. Okay, are we all clear with that instruction? So that is the procedure for uploading. Okay, so are we, are we clear with that? Okay, remember I, I said we, you download the paper here. Okay, this is the link where you can get the paper. Okay, and then after that, what you do is you are going to answer the questions. Okay, so you are going to answer the questions. After answering those questions, there is, there is a button there which says there is a button you say submit then you are going to click on it okay and then when you click on the submit button it will redirect you to our drive it will redirect you to the stem digital school drive okay so that is where all our files are so then since it so then since it will redirect you there then that is when that is how you will be submitting okay then since we have a question where you have to write an instruction text and that one it could really be a long question to answer then what what then what will happen in that case will be after you you after you answer it you have to take a screenshot of where you have answered it and then upload that screenshot okay so that is what i have that is what i meant do you all understand that are we all clear about the submission process Are we all clear about the submission process? Okay, I see a lot of yes, 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 yes. So I'm glad, I'm glad all of you, you do understand what it is that we you are required to do. Okay, so yes, that is what we will be doing. Okay, and so no, there won't be any lesson for us today. Today I was just showing you how what to do so that you so that you can be able to do the the assessment. Okay, and tomorrow and yes, tomorrow and Friday we are going to be answering the questions. I, I will show you what you had to do, how, how those questions you had to answer them, okay? Okay, so is there, is there anyone who has went to the link right now and was able to, to get the, the questions? Okay, so is there is there anyone who has went to the website and was able to get the questions for the test? 
remember what I said. I said the test is due. The test is due tonight by 10 p.m. And tomorrow and Friday, we will be going through those questions and I will be showing you how you had to answer them. Okay. So is there anyone who's having problems to download or to get access to their paper? Because there are people here who, who were, there are learners here who were able to get the paper so that they can be able to help you. So if you were, if you were able to get the paper, please raise your hand and I'll give you a chance to speak to everyone so that you can tell them what you did to get access to the paper. If you were able to get the paper, please raise your hand so that you can tell everyone else how you were able to get it. Is there anyone who can who, who was able to access it? And you can see that, yeah, from where you were accessing it, you, were, you will be able to answer it. And there is a submit button somewhere towards the end. If you, if you have been able to access it, please raise your hand so that you can help others. Let us help each other to access the paper. Yes, uh, sir. Uh, yes. So when I type this website, um, yes, yes, when I go in, like it just say it can't be found. I don't know why. So you you typed Africa Teen Geeks dot yes. yes, sir. Yes, sir. Is, okay, I think what you can do try to access it from 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 Google search. Okay. Yes. Thank you, sir. Okay. You'll get back to us, okay? Okay. Thanks. Yes, sir. Uh, so the first time I tried it, I couldn't access. I couldn't access it. Then I tried yes. it again. It didn't work. Okay. So the second time, what did it do for it to work for you? So I did the same thing. Oh, so you so okay. So you did the same thing. The yeah, first so time, I tried it, it the work. first time. So it took it took me back to the the same page. Then I pressed grade eight, grade eight, then English home language, then it took me, now it took me to the test. Okay, so you're able to access the test? Yes, sir. And then, and then somewhere there, there is a submit button where you can press submit after you've answered the questions. Yes, sir. Okay, thank you, thank you. Thank you so much, Inkanka, thank you. I hope everyone, you heard what Inkanka said. Okay, that he said he tried for the first time and he and he didn't succeed but the second time when he tried again he was able to access the the paper so he so he said after choosing grade eight then it it took him to where the paper is and now he's fine he he got the paper okay all right so is everyone okay with accessing the paper Okay, so all right, we have Helene hand is up. Uh, hello, sir. Yes, Helene. Yes. Uh, yes, sir. Now the second time I tried it, I like I found the um, there's some places I typed wrong. Now I typed it right again, and I found it. Okay, so now it's all like, good. Yes, it's all good. Okay, thank you, thank you so much. saying where's the button for uploading so do did you all see the button for uploading remember it could be difficult you know that is why we are giving this time to make sure that every every question about the test itself can really be addressed okay because after after this lesson ends you will be all alone okay you'll be all alone 
and and it's going to be difficult for you to to really get help okay so this is the best time for you to really get help about how to access the the test okay yes the there is the scrub there is the uploading button and the button to upload you will find it when you scroll to the bottom so thank you so much Inkanka, for telling us that natalie also says is where you will find the the uploading button i see helene's hand is All right, so yes. Okay, like section one, for example, remember in section one, you have to write a, in section one, in section one, you have to write an instruction text. Okay, so in, since an instruction text is going to be a longer text, you know, this go, it is going to be a, a longer text then for that one you may need to you may need to to scan or to take a screenshot of what you will have been writing and then after that you'll have to send it back on the right side where there is a button which says to upload pictures photos or copies okay 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 so let's say it says they put section one twice is that correct so if they put it twice, what you can do, just, just answer it twice, just to be safe. Okay. So what you can do since it is, since it is the same section. Okay. Yeah, so if you realize that section one, it, it has been put twice and it is the same question. So you can just answer both questions in the same way. Okay. So I think that is the best way to go about it. So remember section one, section one, it is your, it is creative work. Okay, so since you will be writing it and take a screenshot, then you can just write it, take a screenshot, then upload that screenshot twice. Okay, so yes, thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much for raising that up, Lissiri. I think it will help everyone. Yes. So remember, since this is an, an assessment, this is the only time where we can get to help each other because after, after this ends, it will be every learner by himself, you know, every learner by themselves. Every learner by himself, every learner by herself. Okay, we have Mausa saying that he or she doesn't see the upload button. Is there anyone who can help? Anyone who can help Mausa with the upload button? Is there anyone who has seen the upload button and can help us to locate the upload button? Okay, so the upload button, it, you can find it, it is at the right. Okay, let's see, let's see. Yes, yes, yes. Um, the upload button it is at the right side of of your screen okay so it should be at the right side okay mouse the upload button is at the right upload or submit yes it is at the right okay so please check it check it if it's there do you all agree that it is at the right side at the end of the test Okay, I see Inkanka has a question, but I... Okay, so Mausa, everyone is... Okay, Mausa, this, it is at the end, at, at the right, okay? So at the end of the paper, on the right, you will see the upload button, it is there. Okay, so it is written, okay, it is green and it is written in white and it is at the bottom of the last question, which is question 2.7.
Are we all together on that? Remember, now you're only left with eight minutes, so please, so please go to the website, check if you can access the papers, check if they, check if you can find the submit buttons, you know, because after this lesson, it could really be difficult for you, even if you can email me to help you with that, but I can't really help you that much, you know. So yes, it will be better now, it's best now that you ask right now when everyone is here so that you, you can see. Okay, are we all are we all good with that? Are we all okay? Okay, let us see, let us see. So we have Lesedi saying, for question 2.1, there is nowhere where you can type your answer. Is that true? Is there anyone who can be able to type their answer for question 2.1? Is there anyone who can be able to type their answer for question 2.1? Okay, Natalie says they can. Natalie, can you please uh, raise your hand so that you can speak to us so that you can help everyone to know what they can do to answer question 2.1. Okay, so they say if you're having if you're having problems of typing for question 2.1, please refresh your please re refresh the page, refresh the site. Yes, refresh. You know how to refresh, right? There is that button. Yes, there is that arrow which looks like it's a circle. You can press it, it will refresh. If you're using a touchscreen device, if you press that, it will refresh. If you're not using a touchscreen, you can just go it on your browser, it will refresh. It doesn't matter what browser you use, the refresh button is the same for all of them. So is there any other question, any other concern? So did you all find the place where you can be able to upload the screenshot for, for section one? Chances are for section one, you may not have enough space to answer that question for section one. Therefore, you may need to take, you may need to write it somewhere and take a screenshot to upload it. Now, did you find, did you find, did you find the upload button on the right side for you to upload your, your scan or your screenshot? Are we all okay? Okay, I see a couple of yeses in the chat. Seems like everyone is okay. That everything is good as far as the excess of the test is concerned. Okay, is there any other question? You are only left with five minutes.
Okay, so it's okay. We have Nkanka's hand is up. So okay, yes, Nkanka. So does it want me? Does it want me to when I'm done? Do I just press the submit button then? Is at the when when I, is it gonna give me an option to upload my picture or something? Um, I think you you are going to press submit when you are done with everything. Yeah, but so I'm saying. As I do section one, I'm gonna write on a piece of paper. So then, how I, when I press submit after answering the question that I can type, that do I is it gonna give me an option to upload a picture? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, so after okay, after that you should check for you should check for the upload button. Okay, so remember you have to upload before you submit. Okay, so look for the upload button. Okay, all right. Yeah, so check for the upload button first before you submit. Okay, do you get that in Kanka? Do you, do you understand? So yes, everyone, that is what you are going to need to do. Remember, when you only submit when you have done everything. Okay, when you have answered all the questions, that is when you submit, okay? So I think what, what, I, what I can advise you, I can advise you to start with section two. You know, you can start with section two after you're done section two, then go back to section one. Okay, Natalie's having a problem to upload. Is there anyone else? Is there anyone who have managed to upload? Natalie, please talk to us. What did you do? Why is it saying that? Okay, let me put Natalie to speak to us. Good morning, sir. Yes, Natalie, how are you? So I can't find the upload button. For uploading your screenshot? Yes, sir. Mm. Uh, okay, let's see. Mm, now, that, now that is a problem. Okay, okay, let us try this. Okay, for section one, remember, since you are writing in instruction text, and uh, instruction text does not need paragraphs, you remember that? Then just try, okay, what you can do, just write, just write it inside, inside that text box and see what happens. Okay, so for, for section one, please answer section one the same way as you'll be answering section two, okay? Since instruction text doesn't need paragraphs, is is bullet points or what? Is bullet points or numbering is sentences, is a couple of sentences, so please just write those sentences inside that box in section one. Okay. Yeah, I think yes, let, let us try that. Thank you, sir. Okay, so thank you so much. So you you all had right. Let us leave the screenshot thing. Let's let us write the transaction text inside that box instead. Okay. So if you and see how and see what happens. So if you still be encountering problems, you can email me. Okay, you can take my, they, all right, there is my email. Uh, okay, so there is my email. So please, please, please email me. So yes, you, you, you can email me. Remember, you only email me about the accessibility issues. Don't ask me what is the answer for a specific question, okay? That one I won't tell you. <laughs> okay, so that is my email there in red. So please don't hesitate, email me, and I will get back to you as soon as I possibly can. Okay, so remember the deadline is 10 p.m. tonight, okay? So please do it as soon as possible so that you can, you know, so do it as soon as possible. You know, it will be good for you to do that. Okay, so this is the end. Remember, if you have a question, please email me. There is my email there. As soon as I see your email, I will get back to it. Okay. So thank you so much. All the best with all, all the best with the assessment. I will see you again tomorrow, same time, same place, as we will go through it, as I'll be showing you how you should have answered the questions. So remember to stay home, stay safe, wash your hands, wear your mask. 
uh, practice social distancing. From all of us here, STEM Digital School, we love you. Goodbye, take care. Until we see each other tomorrow, bye-bye.